Hi everyone and welcome back to uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm by Dishes Gamer and this is my playthrough. Um, we're quite far into it now, so if you haven't seen the other episodes, just go back on my playlist. And um, you can see them all there, as long, uh, along with the playthrough of God of War and Spider-Man. Um, in this one, what I'm going to do is speak to Dutch. And we're going to carry on with the main story, because we've been kind of doing side missions and helping other people out. But we're going to focus on Dutch and the Vandalin gang in this one. And just kind of see where the story goes, because I want to move on with it. So, without holding on, let's just get on with it, and uh, yeah, see where it goes. Alright, so here we are again in camp. Now, oh, now the last time we played, um, or the last episode, was the Mary Linton episode, I believe. Um, and... That was kind of an old love interest of Arthur. And we helped her brother Jamie out and saved him. So we've we've done lots of other things. We've cleared a lot of missions, um, side missions to help other people. But now we're going to see what Dutch needs or wants from us. Right. Here we go. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet. But Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. So before I carry on, I'm just gonna What's wrong, quickly Arthur? feed my horse. So off camera, um, I just I, I don't do anything related to the story progression or the development of the game. But I love playing this game, and when I don't have time to record, I just kind of ride round and do a bit of random hunting. Um, so I've been to a fence in Saint Denis and seen some of that area. I won't spoil it for you guys just yet. Um, so I've got some new I'm gloves, beat. a new hat, we finally get off that mountain, then this. and a, a, another few Mike items. I've also traded in some perfect off. pelts, which I managed to get. Um, I actually killed an alligator, a black bear. That I was random, though, the black bear. What we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Mike, a new. Drink some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. 
Forget about Mike. It was Drank that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? Oh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. <laughs> if you say so, Arthur. Um, I also... I also, um... Picked up a new gun holster. So I can now carry two um, handguns at once. Once again, these are things I got from Saint Denis. I'll, sh I'll show you on the map, actually. So I just went for a ride, and I got to about here, and there was a black bear literally just running backwards and forwards. Um, it wasn't coming after me or anything, it was just kind of running backwards and forwards, I think it had glitched. Um, so I got my rifle out and I shot it in the head, and I skinned it and it turned out to be a perfect pelt. So I took it to the fence, which is... Where is it? Where's the fence? This guy here. Oh, the trapper, sorry, I took him to the trapper. And while I was at the trapper, I got the new harness as well, the new belt, <clears throat> excuse me, which allowed me to get a second revolver or pistol put onto my belt. So little little tweaks and upgrades, but when I come down to St. Denise, I'll be showing you all that anyway, and, and uh, showing you the guy I went to. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. Yeah. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mikey... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People have been leaving me alone for the last... Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. <laughs> but me and the kid here, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just trying to be friendly. <laughs> I think the other option I had was to smash the bottle oh. over his head. <laughs> And I promise no trouble. So I'll, I'll stick That's to my word. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? Hey, you see my friend anywhere? Sorry, I don't know. Lenny? Hey, Lenny! Can't find my friend. You know where he went? Afraid I don't know. This is cool. What are you doing, kid? Hello, Arthur. You know what? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> 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 smashed. 
this is brilliant. Thing, see, cause it... Lenny? He's gone again. <laughs> Lenny! Get away from me! Lenny, where are you at? Oh, come on. Well, I'm, I'm on my way, man. <laughs> I'm loving this. Hey, you know where Lenny is? Don't ask me. He's on the bar. Lenny! Leave the kid alone, you goddamn animals. Who do you think you're talking to? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get lost, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah. Shut your mouth, mister. <laughs> <laughs> this is brilliant. Uh, um, I, I guess I needed a bathroom break. Oh, God. When did I get outside? This is insane. No, I've only seen May White for six. Um <laughs> I think I fell over the steps. When did what? When did I get like back? This is brilliant. <laughs> <Found you, Lenny. laughs> Been looking all over for you, Lenny. I'm Clyde. You got the wrong fella. Lenny! Lenny! What are you talking about? Lenny, I'm a boy! I like how like the um, the spelling for the uh, interactions is completely changed as well. Gret. There you are, Lenny. What? Hi, Lenny. Oh. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> you, you're, you're a good friend of me, Arthur. Look at the stay me, I'm like caked in mud. Cheers. Cheers. Now you again. I don't want to drown him. Oh god, the show's involved. So that seems like a good night. <laughs> what a night. And I've lost my hat.
That's a new hat, by the way, that I got from St. Denis. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. I've had I've one hell of a night, haven't I? That was not a quiet time. Let's have a look at the goals. So Arthur takes sorry. <laughs> Arthur takes Lenny for a quiet drink and Valentine to help to calm him down after learning of Micah's arrest in Strawberry. Try to make amends with an old rival. Who was that? Catch Lenny in the act. Well, I didn't get arrested, which is good. Wait, wait. <laughs> I need to fix my stamina because I'm literally, I don't have any. You can rest by holding triangle. Your cause will not drain while resting and will you fall slightly if they're very low. Cool, I didn't know you could do that. Awesome, that's completely new. I don't, I don't even know where I am. That's mica and strawberry. So I thought this was a mission for Dutch. It turns out it's not. I don't have my horse. Chesapeake Bear Retriever. Yeah. You okay, boy? Oh, look at that tail wag. He's happy. Watch where you're going. I'm sorry. I'm hungover. Up we go. So who's the stranger? Ah, this book. Yeah, do you smoke, sir? Sure, <laughs> perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some, take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? Oh, absolutely, Kate and Mud. Long journey or something? <clears throat> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. Cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh... And the amount of money? <laughs> a veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. 
Oh, of course. Yeah. But, you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now, you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Ramsbottom, at your service. Okay, I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. So I actually have a few of these cards. Um, two horse ones and a gunslinger one, I believe. So, Phineas Ramsbottom is a king collector and trader of cigarette cards, which I found inside premium cigarette packs and combined to create 12 card sets, each with its own theme. He informed you that these cards are valuable to the right buyer and is willing to pay well for each completed set mailed to him. There you go. Famous gunslingers, artists and poets, vistas of America, gems of beauty, flora of America, stars of the stage, fawn of the North, of North America, marvel of marvels of travel, world champions, amazing inventions, breeds of horses, prominent Americans, and all card sets posted. Okay. Cool. Now the problem lies in getting back because my horse is certainly at a whistling dis distance. So I don't. Oh wow. Okay. And there's another one there. It's just while I'm here, like I might be able to find a horse. To be honest. And I've got my handguns on me, which is good. Feels weird having a hat. I like having that. I mean, that was a crazy night. It's what happens when you drink too much. You end up in the middle of nowhere, and you lose your hat. I just don't understand this at all. Hey, over here. What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem for me, but not for you. All right. <laughs> I ain't got time for no, this. No, no, wait! Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. I'm sure you will have heard of me. Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. Can't say I have. There has been much written about me. I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. I helped liberate South America. I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. I have had many women. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. But tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku in the Japanese archipelago in search of the legendary Tokushima Sapphire. Well, good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jack Hall gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of, but me? Huh. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes. Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of $10. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. I'll do it, I'll buy it. I mean, I could rob him. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm trying to be the moral what? guy who does the a right very thing. very wise investment. I wish you the best And what's ten dollars? So you've acquired a map that is said to show the location of the notorious Jack Hall gang lost treasure. Use the map to search for the treasure. Oh god, 
the, honestly. These maps just aren't that detailed, so it's really hard to figure stuff out. And I need a horse. Because otherwise, that is a long run back. Where's this? Oh, that's that burnt out town. I'll see if... Oh god. I'll go back to the station and I'll see if I can get a train back to uh, Valentine. I don't know if I should go back to Valentine considering I got chased by sheriffs. I don't see what other option I've got right now. Random events round here. Don't put your hands higher and push. Come on, come on, show me something. You better not drop it. You better not. Come on, you pair of cream pies. Do you want this rally to what happen? The hell are you fools? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, what? He started it. <laughs> so many funny things have happened in this episode, just like... How random was that? They were like, putting a cross up, a crucifix, and just, uh, spooked him. Because they had a horse as well, and I spooked the horse. Mushroom. I don't know what to do because I feel completely like stuck right now. Dude, dude, come on, man. This is the last thing you'll ever hear. That time you got beat. At least hit me properly. Next time, avoid me. I opened the Oh my no he's uh, you know it was an accident. I bumped into him. Sorry, mister. Get away from me! Help! Sir! You there! Wait! Watch out! Hey, 
Oh, you know, it's just what not my day, really, is it? About this. No one's gonna know anything. Come on, untie me. You always get looted. That's what happens. Now, an insult. Lost a bit more on the but it's okay. It's worth it. Loose already. In God's name, help! Please don't. Make I don't, I can't, I don't know if he's going to tell police or not, oh, well, sheriffs or not. Dude, don't go running off the edge. So I'm, I'm, looks like I'm running back to camp. Stuff is just not going right for me. Oh. It's a freestyle whitetail as well. I have no idea if this is the most efficient way, but I've started to finish. All the horses belong to somebody. All right. What, mister? Come on, that horse can't belong Come to anybody. On. Got a saddle. I just want to make sure my horse actually is in Valentine. Yes. Honest, I forgot about cinematic mode. Yeah. It's kind of nice, just kind of relaxing.
it still blows me away how much detail's in this game, you know. Just kind of what Rockstar have accomplished is ridiculous when you think about it. If anyone knows how to clean my clothes, like if you know how to clean your clothes and be more presentable, could you tell me? Because I, I know how to, you know, I can go and get a bath now. So if I go in the hotel, I can get a bath. Hello, welcome. You arrange the bath, I need a wash. I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. This reminds me of The Witcher as well. Kind of the bath scene in Witcher 3. Would you like someone to take over for you? Oh yeah, and you can do this. Sure, sounds good. Get the deluxe treatment. Sit back and relax, son. And you can have small talk and things like that, but I'm actually going to turn that off just to kind of speed through the process. Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. If you don't mind, I ain't in much of a talking mood. Oh, I'm sorry. Just lie back then. Not a problem. Like, where's her hand going? I reckon you can wash somewhere else now. Of course. Especially here. Yeah, that's very Geralt. Just like with the uh, with the Lego. Clean enough for now. Sure. I'm good. Bye, hun. Really need to clean my jacket. It's an absolute mess. Yep. The sheriff keeps a tight rein on this place. Not at least he can... Thank you. The services menu. Can I get my stuff cleaned here? No, it's just rent a room or bath. <clears throat> Excuse me again. And there's my horse. Hello. Right, so now I've got my horse back, which I'm very pleased about. Um I say we go and get Micah. Get him out of jail. Now we might be able to pay his bail, but if he murders somebody, which is, I think that's what Lenny said. We might have to break him out, which I'm looking forward to. Um, I don't know if we've got some dynamite or anything like that. Turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. 
I told him where to stick it, and well, I guess you just saw how that panned out. Wow, my arm is really high now. Not a bad hat. Oh god, it's got like a bullet hole straight through his face. Like the the damage on you know the representation of damage in this game is just ridiculous. And quite graphic at times. Yep. Yeah, the old man didn't seem like he was doing any harm, he was just trying to, like, I think he was building a home or something for himself. Like, if that's a plot of land and he's trying to build a home, you're not extorting protection out of him, that's just ridiculous. So I've never been to Strawberry, so this should be fun. Good. Oh, there's some right there. Oh, it's our Driscolls. I have no qualms about killing those guys. I do, however, need to refill. There you go. My dead eye. And the car, mainly. I'm hoping strawberry is nice. Maybe a little bit bigger than Valentine. Wow. 
Wow, there's a lot of stranger missions. Where's a foreman? Hey there. Can I help you? Just taking a look. We're with the Appleseed Timber Company. Head foreman. We're still getting started on this site, but we should have some fine big valley lumber for sale very soon if you're interested. I'll keep that in mind. We should be further along by now, but what can you do? Wait, look at these dolts. There's not a brain between them. Listen, you got any supplies for sale? Food, medicine? We're starting to run low. I can't spare anyone to go into town. Not the way things are going. I'd be happy to pay premium for them. Yes, yeah, sure, I might have some stuff. Um... Let's sell one of them, one of them, one of them, one of them, one of them. Basically anything that I'm following because I will like pick some up eventually again. Nice doing business. Going. Cool. Okay. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, boy. Look at that tail wagging. It's always a good look at him. Well, happy. Another one, seriously. I need food. Well, I've got more repeat and stuff on me. Oh, I'm in bad sorts here. I took a little jolt and have managed to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Can't think of a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Shall I ho hop up there on the, on the back with you? Your legs work, don't they? <sighs> well, yes, I suppose. It's just a little uh, demeaning. Well, I was going to say get him on the horse, but okay. What are you doing out here anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I, uh, no, I'm just visiting. I, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't say. Oh, yes. There was some talk at the country club about this burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. So I thought it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. Turns out I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, Dan? It's a town of splinters. If you could call it much of a town at all. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. I'm not sure there's much point in these petty raids. I suppose some might call it charming. <laughs> Let me tell you, charm is not worth much these days. You show me a timber frame shack and I'll show you Come Broadway. Come on, mate, you can't be holding me up. And meanwhile, you have this mayor, a quite intolerable blowhard. A little bespoke woodwork and he thinks this is a cultural hub? The man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. He must be quite the salesman. He did get me out here after all, more fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. N no offense. Little taken. 
I'm just thinking, like, if I was playing this as, like, um, quite an immoral outlaw. Oh, I remember that! We're on the path! My first protocol would be just to rob him <laughs> and leave him be. Rob him, leave him at Millet Woods. But I'm not playing it that way. So easy there, girl. Oh, cool. Okay, yeah. <laughs> You've rescued me from the depths. You seem quite the resourceful sort, sir. If for some reason you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is definitely off with him. Right, so I'm taking a bit of an interest right. in this mayor. Keep that in mind. Evening, friend. Uh, New Yorkers. Jesus. Right, guys, because it's taken so long to get to Strawberry, can I hitch my horse? Evening. Because it's taken so long to Strawberry, what I'm going to do is leave it here. We're in Strawberry. Jail is literally there. <clears throat> Excuse me again. So when we start the next episode... That's my first part of call. I'll go straight to the jail. We'll commence that mission with uh, trying to free Micah. Um, this place looks cool, though. I like the look of it. It's on a river. Look, it's on a, like a river. It's a little bit bigger than Valentine as well. Some nice houses. Right. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. I'm Bodacious Gamer, you are my Bodacious viewers, as always. I like I like Strawberry, it's pretty cool. This episode's been very fun. We got smashed. Come on, we got absolutely wrecked. Um, so yeah, I'll see you next time. Please subscribe, Good click evening, the bell friend. if you would like to keep up with the latest releases. And check out my playthrough of Spider-Man as well if you haven't seen it, if you're interested. Uh, the next DLC for that actually starts on the 20th and I will be uploading episodes of that as well. Thank you so much, guys. I'm Bodacious Gamer. I'll see you later. Bye.